Hi, this is Melanie from Hook to the Left and today I'm going to show you a cotton haul that I got from Lion Brand. So let's go ahead and get started. Hi, thank you so much for joining me here today. If you're a fan of all things yarn or crochet, then go ahead and go down below and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell so that you're reminded each time I come out with a brand new video. So today I'm going to show you what I got with this amazing sale item that I got from Lion Brand. So um, I'm going to link it up above, but Creative Grandma, um, Glinda, I think her name is Glinda, um, Creative Grandma posted a note, and this is just after I made an order for, for the clearance sale items for Lion Brand. Um, but she posted a video showing you all this amazing deal on the re-up cotton. So you were able to get a skein for 87 cents. I think it was 87 cents a piece. So you know what I did? I went in, I got every color. <laughs> I got three skeins, I believe, of every color. So let me tell you a little bit about this yarn and then I will show you the colors that I got. But I, I went a little hog wild, but you know, you can't go wrong with cotton right and this is this is going to be great i probably won't do i may not do any um projects with it right now um but i i well you know i do have the the tail towel toppers that i need to get done so they may end up on that but anyway let me tell you uh, more about this yarn so this is lion brand re-up yarn and it says here, save the planet stitch by stitch. Recycled cotton saves 5,900 cups of water per ball. So I think that's pretty cool, this this idea of, um, you know, reusing, reduce, reuse, and recycle, right? A little bit more about this, uh, this particular yarn. This, uh, it comes in two point, the each skein comes as 2.1 ounces or 60 grams, 103 yards or 94 meters. It is 100% recycled cotton. It is a four weight yarn. They recommend a four and a half millimeter needle or a five and a half millimeter crochet hook. And it is machine washable and dryable. This particular colorway is called Cotton Candy. How pretty is that? Some pretty colors there. So that is Cotton Candy. And that's the information about this particular yarn. I did get three skeins of each color now this one the bag that it came in um, open so if the other ones the bags are not open I'm not gonna pop open the bags for you but this is what it's called it is very much feels like a kitchen cotton as opposed to a wearable cotton so it's not as soft as I love this cotton or mainstays cotton but it is a great kitchen cotton again this particular colorway is known as cotton candy this colorway which I'm not gonna open these because they're nice and sealed in this in packs of three but this colorway is called blue navy it's a blue marine but it is a very dark blue if you can see there it's a very dark blue Okay, and then I got, remember these were like less than a dollar a piece. So this is what, the, they're white, which is officially called white. Um, but I did get some white cotton. Right, and then I got this colorway. Um, and you know, let me take a look at this because it feels like the solid colors are a little bit, have a little bit more in them and they do okay so the solid colors are two and a half ounces 70 grams as opposed to the variegated which is 2.1 ounces and 60 grams and then um, the solid colors are 117 yards or 107 meters whereas the variegated are 103 yards and 94 meters so that's something to keep in mind with these the solids have more in them as opposed to the variegated all right so this is also a variegated this particular colorway is called bubble gum which yeah that looks like bubble gum to me right that looks like some bubble gum to me so that's a variegated and so there's a little bit less than that and you can i can feel the difference between the two um all right so the next colorway is a red and they call it red so it's a nice bright red it's a yellow based red or orange based red as opposed to a blue based red but it is a very pretty color um 
No, I like that a lot. I like I like getting these solids here. Um, all right, so the next color, this is another variegated, and this is the last of the variegated that I got. And this one is called Azul, or blue, which is funny. It looks more green to me. I guess there's a lot of blue in it, but uh, you know, I see a lot of green more. I, I wouldn't have called it blue, but that's okay. I'm not the one naming it. Somebody else is doing the naming. So that's that colorway in the Reup Cotton. Right here's another solid. It looks like a, a turquoise to me. They call it aqua, which makes sense. Yeah, it's more aqua than turquoise. Turquoise tends to be darker. That's that colorway, but this is of course black, and and that's what they call it. They call it black. Get out of there, bud. They call it black. So that's the black. Then I've got um, or an orange color here, and they call it orange. So we have orange, uh, I have a nice green color, which I love this green, it's like an apple green. They call it lime, which yep, I'd call it lime too. So they, there's the lime, and then lilac, because it's a lighter purple. So see my Halloween colors? Hang on, I'm going to stack them on top of each other so you can see. Look, it's Halloween colors! Halloween colors, yay! So that is my box of cotton yarn, and uh, yeah, I was really excited to get this. The whole thing, all total, came out to I think um, I got 33 skeins of yarn, skeins of yarn, um, and it came out all total to about 27 dollars, I think, even with shipping and tax. So $27 for all these yarns. It's a lot of cotton and um, yeah, so I'm gonna be able to get some projects done, maybe summer projects, maybe some kitchen projects and stuff like that done with this. But um, yeah, I'm so excited about this. All right, so hey, what would you make with all this cotton yarn? Do you have any ideas? Would you put it away and wait till the spring to make something with it? Um, or would you go ahead and make something up right now? Um, let me know what you think and what was your favorite color? Did you have a favorite color? I know I got a lot of solids, but did you like the variegated better or do you like the solids better? Let me know. I'd love to hear your comments down or read your comments down below. Um, if if you really enjoyed this video, then please don't hesitate, hesitate to go down below, hit that thumbs button, thumbs or that like button or the thumbs up button. And uh, while you're down there, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet and hit the bell so that you're reminded each time I come out with either a new live video or um, a new video like this. And uh, I can't wait to see you guys again. Thank you so much for joining me here today. You guys have an amazing day. Bye-bye.